Another week goes by and we wait yet again for an announcement by the SEC. However, it's not all bad news for XRP. We're holding 60 cents. There's some pretty bullish news and a lot of people are expecting a breakout to the upside as well as, well, a big deal coming to XRPL. That's right. I'm going to break it all down for you in this video. So if you're part of the XRP army, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel for all your latest updates. With that being said, let's get into this one. So as always, everybody, don't forget to turn that notification bell on so you're updated every time we post a video, whether it be Jasmine, XRP, all the latest news. But this one is a good one. Everybody, including me, have been talking about a potential SEC settlement. We were hoping for it yesterday, that behind closed doors meeting. We simply didn't get it. That's just life. We all move on. The next date on everyone's mind is the 31st of July. Hopefully, we get a little bit more bullish news and potentially even the settlement. Now, don't forget... Robert F. Kennedy Jr. announced today that if he was elected into office, he would bring in a Bitcoin reserve. We expect Donald Trump to do exactly the same thing tomorrow. We then see American politics moving pro cryptocurrency. This is going to be good news for XRP. It will be good news from a settlement perspective, especially when, you know, you don't want to be the outcast that is negative against crypto when everybody in the White House is flipping bullish. But that's not what I'm here to talk about. Obviously, there is another big narrative that's going on with Ripple that I think a lot of people neglect. A lot of people don't talk about. I've discussed it a lot on this channel. I think it's really important to reference is the XRP ledger. Now, Ripple X, the development arm of Ripple, has been really working around AI and liquidity providers. Don't forget, they launched the AMM over here as well. They've just launched Filed GR. This is an AI system protocol. Well, that's pretty interesting when it talks about data authentication. Very key as we walk through this. So what's exactly happened? Well, look, utilizing XRP Ledger filed GRMs to improve AI systems through advanced data solutions, including digital certificates and a digital twin data hub. Now ask yourself, why would digital certificates be important when we talk about XRP or cryptocurrency in general? Well, if we truly want to see mass adoption on the blockchain, well, you could think about anything, mortgage rates, financial infrastructure, loans, and much, much more. So I think this is very interesting that this would be built out by Ripple X and launched on the XRPM. So say Ripple's development arm, Ripple X has recently presented a new project dubbed Filed GR within the XRP ecosystem. The new project will use XRP Ledger to provide advanced data authentication as well as management solutions to enhance artificial intelligence AI systems. Very interesting indeed. Quote, Filed GR stands out as offering unique features like digital certificates and a twin digital data hub revolutionizing industries with authenticated data and fostering trust in product information i think if you read between the lines this is a key part of financial infrastructure and more importantly all of those big players that are going to come to it digital certificates as well as fostering trust and authenticated data think about how something like visa works how transactional payments work it is a send an authentication and then the transaction happens so this i think is very important and again something that i don't believe a lot of people are talking about obviously we're going to keep you updated with all of this but i think once again it is all the work going on in the background ahead of that settlement announcement remember that it's just a monetary value that we get from the sec and we can all move along and i think that's where it is key now obviously there's a debate around whether we get this conclusion when it all builds out i guess for now it'll be what it'll be we know judge not Torres likes to do things on a Friday, 31st, potentially a lot of people talking about, we'll have to wait and see. But people are talking about a key resistance at 66 cents. That's what we're looking for, a potential break above. Now, the market holding strong on a lot of that announcement around the US Bitcoin reserves, whether that will come into effect or not, we'll have to wait and see what Donald Trump talks about tomorrow and ultimately if he gets elected. But if XRP breaks the key resistance, 66 cents is just the beginning. Lots of us believe that. When you look at the charts, we know volume sits on the side. We know that there's been a number of events that have happened with XRP that when we see some really bullish news, volume flows into this token. I think it's very important to reference, but a critical 60 cents where we currently hold, we want to see that push up a bullish trend outperforming BTC would be good news. And actually we've seen a 26% rise over the last month. So absolutely XRP is performing better than most, which I think is very important and continues to be pretty bullish. You only have to take a look at this chart with this potential breakout above that 60 cent line. That's what we're looking for, this descending triangle. Interestingly, you can even go back 
in a bigger time frame and really see this big triangle that we are waiting to break. So I think there's a lot of positivity right now. Yes, we need the settlement announcement. That's just reality. It doesn't matter how many partnerships we've got. It doesn't matter what goes on in the background. We need that settlement. And I think if it's absolutely in our favour, expect a big rise. I would reference though, here on the weekly chart, we are now in our fourth week of green. That's uptrend for XRP. We bottomed out here around 40 cents when the market took that correction, but we have subsequently moved out. And actually, if you were to go over the course of probably the last month, the only other time we saw this bullish move where we had three consecutive weeks in a row was back here in October of last year. So this is a positive trend to the upside. Yes, it might not be 10% that we've seen in other tokens. It might not be that big move of three, four, five percent However, it's green and it is moving in the right direction. Yes, we're hitting this resistance level at around 60, 63 cents that we need to see a break above and then once again retesting at 74 cents. But the settlement announcement would absolutely give us that as well as some of these partnerships going on in the background. So we may not have got exactly what we wanted this week, but when you read between the lines, there's still lots of stuff coming that we need to be bullish about. We'll obviously keep you updated with everything going on with XRP. All you have to do, click that notification bell, click all, subscribe to the channel and you'll get all the latest you're going to need for your XRP info. As always, thank you so much for watching the video. Don't forget, we're here every day to keep you updated and we'll see you very soon. Take care. Bye-bye.